All right. Um. Wait, is this thing like... Wait a minute. No, the stream's not unlisted. Okay, just no one's joined yet. Okay, never mind. This is kind of funny. <laughs> Zero viewer stream goes so hard. Okay. Okay, why is Gmail just impossible to find? Okay. All right, we back. Hi, Kirby. I'm guessing YouTube just didn't send the notification out, because god damn. This is the longest it's taken for anyone to join. I think I've been live for like four minutes, yeah. play Blood Bowls today, that's fun. YouTube never gives you notifications. I just found this through the beating more nine circles levels video. Wait a minute, what do you mean? <laughs> like, were you rewatching it and it like recommended the stream? You mean? Hi, spicy. How's it going? I'm only playing Bloodlust to like warm up, so yeah, that's why I'm playing this. Okay. But I apparently can't, um. do anything today, so yeah, that's fun.
shittily? Shittily what? <laughs> I mean, I am playing shittily. Oh, wait a minute. I s wait. Did I ask how you were doing? Sorry. The delay between the responses made me completely forget, like, what it is. <laughs> God damn it. Well, my ability to play right now is in the gutter. <sighs> I'm trying to decorate and I'm not happy with any of the results so far. Oh, I see. I see. Average frustration moment. You'll figure it out, I'm sure. I keep forgetting Bloodlust doesn't have a list percent anymore. Oh yeah, that's true. There it is. I always have so much trouble finding where smart start pose is. Wow. Um, okay. <laughs> I don't. I don't know how I did those so fast. God damn. I got the notification from yesterday's stream, like something in the afternoon, or sometime in the afternoon today, and I didn't even get the notification for this one yet. Nice. Your keyboard broke, so you haven't been playing anything hard for a month. Yeah, I mean, maybe it's a good break, though. Possibly, I don't know. Or not, if you just want to play hard stuff. <sighs> Who even remembers Minnesota? Um, I, I forgot it existed. Oh. Hi, Dre. Dakota is more forgettable than Wyoming and you can fight me on this. 
Actually, no, that is true, because why I feel like Wyoming is never, is, like, actually not that forgettable anymore, because people always talk about how forgettable it is. Honestly, it's kind of the same for me with Vermont and, like, Rhode Island and, like, um, New Hampshire as well, because I always talk about how fucking forgettable all of those are. But because I talk about how forgettable they are, they're, like, not forgettable anymore. Hi, Lenny. I died to 83 again from 57 of Mayhem. God damn. Every state is forgettable except Ohio, California, and Florida. Um, I mean, I feel like you're probably missing a few there, like, um, New York, um, Mississippi, probably, um, Texas, <laughs> quite, quite a few, actually. Wait, someone called Philadelphia a state? Huh? frustrating today because uh, I kept dying at a bullshit part that I should be passing. That's every level ever really. <laughs> I still don't know what U235 is because I never bothered to look it up but uh, that's very unfortunate. I've never heard anyone talk about Area 51 since early 2022. Is that when all that shit ha- no, no, that was- wait, wait, when was like the Area 51 raid or whatever the fuck? When- when was that a thing? Wasn't that in like 2021 or something? Like, I don't even know. Forgot that existed. Wow, that was forever ago. You got a good night's sleep last night? That is... Let's go, that's epic. I'm trying to improve my sleep myself. I, uh... I successfully went to bed last night without looking at my phone in bed at all. It was amazing. And I'm going to try to just do that every night for like the rest of my life now. So that I'm not like wasting hours of my life. It wasn't 2019? 
Then when was it? <laughs> what do you mean? September 20th, 2019. Okay, so now we're changing the, di the day in the month at which it occurred, okay. So we have three answers now. We have September 1st, 2019, September 20th, 2019, and not 2019. It was like 2021. That's what I was thinking, because like, there's no way it's been five years since that. I'm trying to think what I, what I was even doing when that happened. My cat dragged a piece of her shit out of her litter box and put it under my desk. <laughs> and now it smells like cat shit over there. <laughs> what the fuck? What kind of a cat does that? <clears throat> Jesus. <coughs> Holy fuck. Okay, I think I'm gonna go back from here. smoking goes hard is that what your pfp is right now so fucking yeah that is annoying as fuck it's annoying as shit really is what it is um bro was saving a snack for later <laughs> oh my god the pea smoker better maybe
I just thought of an April Fool's prank. Unfortunately, it's not April 1st anymore. I mean, yeah, you know. Just wait a year. This shit is, like, stuck to the fucking floor. I gotta scrape it up. Yeah, no, I've had that. Uh, well, I had to... Like, at our old house, we had, like, just, like, a room that we kept the cats in. And, like, whenever I had to clean that thing, sometimes it was really disgusting. So, I, I am familiar with the, uh, the shit stuck to the floor scenario. What do you mean? Do you mean you didn't know what a roller coaster was? Uh, okay. Coasts need to be called trolleys or some shit. It sounds funny. I mean, I guess, but like, isn't a trolley just like, like that's that more so just refers to a vehicle, does it not? Like a roller coaster is sort of like it's like a whole package, you know. It includes like the tracks and the the actual cars themselves, but it mainly just includes the track. The term Russian mountain? What the hell? Boy, what the hell? Like, bro, what's your favorite Russian mountain at Cedar Point? This is culturally different for me, so therefore it's funny. I just don't even know where I should be practicing from on this anymore. <clears throat> I didn't discover what a roller coaster was. They were just called Russian mountains in French and in sp really. Where does that come from? Russian mountains. I get the mountains part, but what about how does how is Russia incorporated into this? I wish I could have ma I could have matching PFPs my, with my GF, but she only uses pictures of her uh, OC as PFPs. We made a matching PFP once. It was when she had art of both her OCs cuddling. It was great. Oh, okay. It was invented in Russia. Well, there you go. There I go. The scariest roller coaster in Six Flags is the Superman one. It goes like 300 feet in the air and you go backwards. It's so fucking terrifying. Look it up. It's fucked. I mean, 300 feet is rookie numbers, but yeah, sure. I'll look that up. I'll look that up now. Let me see. The Literally, the only good thing about Ohio is that we have Cedar Point. I swear to God. Let me see. Wait, what's it called? The... 
I don't know, just look up the Superman Six Flags. <laughs> I don't fucking know, is that? Superman, Ride of Steel, Six Flags, what is this? Or, well, hold on. Let me just go, let me just look up, like, Superman, Ride, Six Flags. Let me see. My best run to 100 is 34 to 100. Okay, what's this thing look like? Hmm. This is not it? Well then, what, what the hell is it? Hmm. Uh, hold on. Okay, I'm back, sorry. Um, okay, well, either way, I, I, I'm just going to go back to, uh, to this. called Superman Escape from Krypton. It was only at the Los Angeles Six Flags. Ah. Oh, it's 413 feet. Okay, okay. Um, I guess I can look it up. I'll try to look it up again. Hold on. Superman Escape from Krypton. Oh, there it is. Okay. Let's see. This thing. Oh, it's just like, is this just like a less extreme version of the dragster? Oh no, it's like, oh okay, I see. It's literally just, okay. Well, that th that's fun. All right.
Watch Pantheon. Uh, I want to play the level, guys. I'm sorry. I don't. Uh, can I please? <laughs> Maybe I can watch it next time. I just I don't want to. I want to make sure I'm making progress on this, cause like you know I want to get it done. Hey, Floridian. Wait, play the love. Yeah, okay. Oh my gosh. No. Sorry. My dog's being a little bitch. Okay. So, no, we should add a silent club of Rome extension. Yeah, Kino's extension. Hold on. We'll oh my gosh, more math. Okay, you know what? Whatever. Fine. Fine. I'm gonna get over my fucking fear of being wrong all the time about math problems. Um, if a wheel had a 50% chance of landing on green, but every time it lands on the other side, the chance of landing on green gets divided by 2. What is the chance of landing on green if you do it infinitely? Well... I mean, I mean, my brain already has an intuitive answer for it, but I'm not going to say it just yet because I want to make sure I'm not going to be wrong. Uh, hold on. Let, let me just. Fifty percent chance of landing on green, but every time it's divided by two. I mean, if you think about that in terms of like the area on the wheel, that's like geometric, right? But like, we're not talking about the whole thing, we're just talking about the smallest final piece. So like, I guess zero. Uh-huh. I mean, wait, you said after infinite, wait, hold on. Let me make sure. Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. You said chance of landing on green, but every time it lands on the other side, the chance of landing on green gets divided by two. Yeah. I mean, I guess. I don't know. Because then, because the smaller the green, the smaller the green gets, the more likely you are as well to land 
on not the green, and then the more likely you are to make it smaller, and it's just going to keep getting smaller until it approaches zero. I don't know. That's my guess. But you say you're like freaking like Terrence Tao genius answer. I don't fucking know. I'm just I, I am an idiot. I am a stupid. And I'm sure I probably mi accidentally read something wrong or something. <laughs> Sun Club of Rome already has a verifier, plus it might get decorated, just so y'all know. I mean, this is very important. Silent Club of Rome is an integral part of GD. Well, I'm stupid whenever I have to actually l look smart in front of people, if that makes sense. I feel like the only time I do anything good is when people aren't watching. <laughs> it's terrible. Like, I'm sure a lot of people think I'm just a fucking dumbass, because, like, I can't act like an actually, like, smart person for the life of me in front of anyone. It's just, it's just not doable. Like, any time I can make myself look like a jackass, I will not fail to do so. That's just how it is. I mean, I guess that's probably how most people feel, but whatever. Let's see, why am I wrong? I misunderstood the question. I meant, what's the chance of landing on green once... Okay, wait, okay, so... I might have to write this out, I swear to god. So... I meant, what's the chance of landing on green once in that infinite amount of time? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Um. See, I don't know if I could even answer that. Like, I would be able to answer it if you said the probability of landing on green halves with each spin, but you said the probability halves each time you don't land on it. So that makes it like way more complicated anyway. So I don't even know if I could do that. Cuz I was cuz if it if it was to shrink well, even then I don't that's like really hard to even think about. Like, hold on. I guess I can try to draw it out, but I mean, I'm probably not going to get anywhere. This is probably just going to be a complete monumental waste of time and it probably also has a really simple answer that I'm just not seeing. So there's that. Um Okay, so okay, uh, let's think about it. So basically, what? So you you have a wheel, and then we'll just say so the shaded part starts out fifty. It's fifty fifty at first, right? Isn't that it? Okay, but then every time it lands on the other side, chance landing on green is divided by two. So like, okay, if you did land on the other side, then you know. Now it's kind, of, it's like this. So like, assuming you did land on the other side all the time. Whatever, I can't draw straight lines. Wait a minute. Yeah, so it's kind of like you're thinking of it like this. So, okay, if you keep landing on it, it's like one over two to the n, right? Because like with zero spins, no, it'd be one over two to the n, plus one yeah okay um but this is assuming you didn't land on it every time which that's obviously not gonna happen um and obviously this right so okay here, my brain where my brain is going with this is this is i mean this the way this is behaving assuming you don't land on the the side 
every single spin it's the same as like you know this geometric series so right should be but then um Well, it's not a sum though. That's the thing. It's not a sum, but it has like a it's a similar idea to that. So never mind. Let's not let's not talk about that. Okay. Let me make sure I'm not Okay, I didn't explain it yet. I probably should just play Arrow Gleam. This is definitely a massive waste of time. I why, why am I Okay, you know what? Let me I I I let me think about it for another minute and then and then I'll just go I'll give up. Um okay. <clears throat> so, basically Also, let me re-look at what he said. What's the chance of landing on green once in that finite amount of time? Oh, I was overthinking. I was completely overthinking. Yeah. It's just gar guarantee. Can you say it's guarantee? Mm. I mean, yeah. Well, cause it's... Mm. Because obviously if you give something an infinite number of chances to occur, assuming the probability doesn't do something weird like it's doing in this problem, it is guaranteed to happen eventually. But I don't know if it's okay to say that it's guaranteed to happen eventually because this is constantly just getting smaller and smaller. So is there a chance that I mean, you know what? Final answer is the probability is one. There you go. I'm done. I, I, I'm just playing Arrow Gleam. I don't fucking care. I, I'm, I'm not wasting time on this. Thank you. I'm gonna jump from shred the bone to slaughterhouse. Yep, go for it. What, did I get it right? I guess I should say, did I guess it right? Because like, I don't know how you would go about proving that. did get me thinking about like a bunch of different scenarios though now like what if that shrank by a different factor so like what if every time you didn't land on it it shrank by like oh well no hold on no I think I know how you could prove it because every time it halves it's still gonna be it's there's still gonna be a possibility that you land on it right no matter what so you could just treat it as the chance of Isn't it the same as, like, the chance of landing on that area of the wheel is 1 as the area approaches 0, given infinitely many tries? Like, I know if you try... Yeah, okay, it was just... It was throwing me off because, like, yes, I, I obviously I know if you do something that has a probability an infinite number of times then it's guaranteed to happen but i didn't know like if there was some some weird thing that could happen to where if that area is constantly shrinking maybe it could somehow like but I, it would never hit zero i guess so whatever that question really was just you just you just made the question like extra complicated to throw me off is what you did obviously but whatever
If it's a factor of 12, it'll... S Wait a minute, what? If it's a factor of 12, it'll still be 100. A factor of anything besides infinity would be 100. Yeah, oh, I shouldn't have said, okay, I worded that wrong. I didn't mean factor. I meant, I, I was referring to if it shrank by some other function, I meant. So, like, not a factor. I meant, like, um, like I don't know, if if the area decreased by, like, Instead of a linear amount, if it decreased by, like, an exponential amount or something. But I, I think even then it, it would still be guaranteed because, you know, no matter what, at each stage, there's always still a chance that you're going to land on it. Because it can, like, it's never going to hit zero, so. It doesn't really matter, but that's what I, that's what I was referring to. If it's exponential, it's most most likely. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Because even if it's exponential, like there's still always going to be some area left that you could land on at each trial. So it should be guaranteed to happen. Because, yeah. But no, that, see, that got me thinking about, like, is there some scenario you could construct in which after an infinitely large number of trials, there is still only a certain percent chance that would happen? Like, I wonder if there is something where you could set that up. Probably not. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm talking about. But you know what I mean? So, like, is there, like, some thing that, you, that if you did it in infinitely many number of times, it would maybe have only, like... A one third chance of actually happening. I don't. That wouldn't make sense. I don't think. <laughs> I'm just. My brain is just going crazy right now. Oh my god, my eye, dude. Holy shit, that felt good. Okay. I can't stop hearing hello, fat fetish artist in my head. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> that shit is so fucking funny. Stop, please. The most diabolical prank ever. The most diabolical prank phone call. Alright. Well, I think I'll probably be able to stream for like exactly two hours today, because... Um, we gotta watch that movie at 7.30, so. I'm actually glad I d decided to check when we were watching that movie when I did, because, um, I had, like, exactly two hours until we started it when I started stream, so it was, like, a huge win. Oh yeah, also, I just answered my question in my head, and it's really, like, the most basic fucking answer ever. I suppose there is something such that you can only have a one-third chance of getting it after infinite trials, and that would be if you land on the- if you don't land on green. So, so like, I don't know, if you wanted to say, like, if you had an infinite- Okay, alright, so let's say if you spun a wheel an infinite number of times, there's only a one-third chance you would land on green. Well, obviously, you could just make it so that, um, if you don't land on green on the first spin, you just get rid of green. <laughs> and then, there you go. But then, that kind of, like, you know... <laughs> I 
I'm like All right. Yeah, no no level requests. Also, there's a chance I might try to do the Windy Landscape donation stream um, before I beat Aerial Gleam. I'm not sure. I guess I'll see. Because but... I still feel like that'd be a really fun idea. And because I'm so consistent with Windy Landscape, it's not going to be $5 for me to rebeat it. It's just going to be $3. So... I think I think that's a fair price cuz like I mean on average I can pretty much just I I probably have like like once I really get into it there's probably like a 70% chance I'm going to beat the level on any attempt or something like that. So like, you know, or you can do 26 but Remove the two greens. Well, yeah, because isn't that that's like literally what I said, right? You just wrote one third is two sixth, <laughs> unless I'm misinterpreting that. Add no level requests to the description or something. Not yeah, no one's gonna read it. Yeah, but I guess I can. Um, I I don't feel like doing it right now, but I'll do it. Um, I like I have to end the stream in order to like update what it automatically sets the description to and then restart it so I'll just um, change it after I end. Learn to beat Oblivion on command and charge people 500 bucks per completion. That would be wild although no no one would pay for that because like I mean in the grand scheme of things no one would really care. <laughs> I mean maybe if I could do that for like a top one <laughs> but obviously that's like not humanly possible. Also, uh, I gotta piss like a racehorse, I'll be back. We back. <clears throat> Pause, hold on, wait a minute, what? Wait, wait, what are you talking about? <laughs> also, I do want to take a quick Windy Landscape break, honestly. funny that this level's a minute and five seconds long, but it feels like an eternity. I'm just gonna play from here for a little bit. You said something devious? Okay, I'm guessing you like deleted the message then, because I do not see it. I do not see said message.
Oh, that's what you said. Oh. Fuck. That implies me. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay. Do your homework on me finally completing a very hard level. Huh. Also, is this, like... I don't think this is the real Silky, because Silky doesn't have a hyphen in his name, but... Oh yeah, that's right, Silky has two Y's in his name too, that's right, I forgot about that. I found a hoodie. It's a cinnamon toast crunch themed hoodie and it's a cinnamon toast champion. It has little dudes in the sleeve. Do I buy it? It's a hundred dollars. That is, you're definitely getting robbed if you buy that, but I mean if you really want it, get it. Because I don't know where else you'd find something like that. <laughs> that was 100% manufactured in Bangladesh for like 12 cents though by like some child slave. an official champion x cinnamon toast crunch collab i don't know what that means but go for it fuck it god it is so hard for me to play this without getting bored i swear Lobotomy level sweater made in Vietnam for four cents, exactly. <laughs> it just has the fucking normal face on it, just like all warped. <laughs> That'd be amazing, actually. I would love that. I'm gonna play Verdant Landscape for just like a quick second. I don't know. I just wanna... 
I don't know why. I just I really like playing from this part of the level because it's fun, and I also like the song a lot here. So. I just need a second to, uh, you know, not look at that horrendous, atrocious level. Getting used to this part um, with the uh, new physics, so that's epic. I'll look at DMs, fine. I mean. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, yeah, that's worth it. That's definitely worth it. You have legal age to get a driver's permit in Florida. Yeah, we are all fucked, you're right. I mean, I'm already enough of a menace on the road myself. I swear to god, driving's like the freest thing ever except when it isn't and you're in like the most annoying situation possible and you don't know what to do. Other than that, it's easy. Like, I remember this one time I pulled out into an intersection when the light was green too early, and then, like, I was just in the middle of the intersection while all these other people had to, like, go f through it, and, like, I shouldn't have done that, <laughs> and I was like, oh, fuck, <laughs> and, uh, it was actually quite terrifying, but, uh, luckily I, I didn't wreck, so... I was playing the recent tab once and I checked a level's comment section and one of the comments was from a bot account and it said, Hiya, I'm cr Yep, and I'm gonna yep at you if you don't click. Okay. I can't wait till I'm playing this level. Holy fuck, it's so good. I still don't really understand why. I, I know a lot of people like kind of don't like Burnout Landscape, which is pretty cringe. I want to see if I can even still play um, this section right here because it's pretty much the hardest part of the whole level. Yeah, well. I literally had to speed hack the fucking game to learn this part initially. Okay, well. I keep forgetting it doesn't go from the last start position you placed anymore. That actually kind of bothers me. Okay, what? Smart start pose is probably fucking everything, isn't it? No? Okay, I just don't know what's going on then. Why is it doing that? Why 
Wait, so you're a dual ship there. Oh, you're mini. Okay, wait. That might explain it. Wait, let's just try this. That should work. There's no way that doesn't work. Unless I also need to flip my gravity. Uh, that might have been the problem. Let's just try that. Oh my god, this is a pain in the dick. Who would have thought setting a single star position would be so hard? Yeah, okay, so there's... Hold on, is there anything to change your gravity here? I don't think so. I'm just going to make it upside down and see if that works. I don't fucking know. Um, nope, okay, it's just broken, and I have no idea why. Um... That's fascinating. I really don't want to put the star position up here because it's not going to be like the same, like it's going to be inconsistent. How, how do you, f how the fuck does one go about uh, fixing this? Okay, whatever, dual mode, f ship. I don't fucking know, I mean. Oh my god. No. No. Okay, I think that's working. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be impossible. Okay, that thing is... I'm dead ass probably gonna have to speed hack that to relearn it. Yeah, I already addressed the problem. Yeah, it is truly is a goaded song. Try to no clip the part. Hold on. Oh, see, I yeah, I forgot so much. Hold on. Yeah. Okay. I don't remember how to play it at all. Okay. That's frustrating. Yeah, I'll be able to watch that today, assuming you're still doing it at the same time. Also, how's it going, Ash? Urban landscape, banana. Blah, 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 blah. I just still don't even know where to play from on this anymore. Like, it just feels like a mosh pit free-for-all. Just, like, pick your start position and go from there. And just hope that it, like, gets you somewhere. I don't even know. This is terrible. Oh, yeah. Uh, thank you for $10, Dre. Uh, here's a quick question. Can I make an AI voice for... M why? <laughs> for what purpose? <laughs> like, what do you... What's the, uh... Um, huh? Oh yeah, Mason's been gone for like ever. Yeah. Okay, sure. How much dollars would you need in order to play an insane demon of my choice? Well, in order to play an insane demon of your choice, um, what do you mean by that? Do you mean beat it? If you mean beat it, then, um, I'm not gonna lie, I really just don't feel like fucking doing that right now, so, like, uh, 
Oh no, I shouldn't have said. You know, and then that's only for you, Floridian. That is specifically for you, Dre. If you try to give me fifty dollars to beat an insane demon, I'm not doing it. It's not happening. I already, I already know what you're gonna try to do. No, just don't. If Floridian wants to give me fifty fucking dollars to beat an insane demon, then fine. Fifty pesos. How devalued is a peso? <laughs> <coughs> I really don't have any fucking credit or debit card yet. I am fifteen. Well, there you go. See, now now I don't have to do it. Fifty pesos is like three bucks. Yeah, see, see. Flory will give me. We'll give fifty Vietnamese dong. God, I forgot that that's a currency, bro. How much for me? And I know. And no, I will not pull out the most down, dirty, disgusting, devious, insane demon of all time. I'll pick an actually good. Oh my god, bro. Am I really gonna do this, bro? Am I? You know, fine. You know what? Fine. I can use a break. Fine. Um. You you really want me to beat an insane demon? I will beat one for a hundred dollars. You give me a hundred dollars, I will beat an insane demon. Fine. I will do it. I'll just play that whenever I'm bored. Until I beat it. And yeah, fake a doom is not allowed. That that is not allowed. Definitely you cannot you cannot make me beat fake a doom. You cannot me, me make me beat the um uh uh fuck I forget what it's called. The the really shitty one or the other really shitty one. A hundred dollars for mental torture. Yep. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Why didn't I say 500? Um, because I already feel like a big enough dick asking for 100, especially when I just said I could use a break, so I, I now it feels even worse. It, it, it's fine. Look, $100. <laughs> $100. I don't fucking know, man. I mean, an insane demon will take me, like, about five hours to beat worst case scenario, right? So there you go. I get that's twenty dollars an hour, twenty dollars an hour for to, for me to beat an insane demon. So, I mean, pick whatever you think. I would I will say I would prefer if it's not like the most learny fucking thing I've ever played. That would be awesome. Because learny insane demons annoy me. I don't mind learny extremes because I expect an extreme to take me a while, but I don't like learny insanes because they're just annoying. I'll 
Oh, one hundred dollars for mental torture. I thought you were just saying actual mental torture. Oh, you meant like there's a level called mental torture. <laughs> I see. If he said ICDX, I don't know how I would feel about that. Because, I mean, on one hand, ICDX is free for most of it, so I'd really just have to get a little lucky, but we all we know me and luck. Um, also, you're right, it probably will be bad. Oh. <laughs> it's a top 50 fucking... Insane demonless memory level. Oh, I'd rather not. <laughs> I would rather not. <sighs> but you know, whatever. I got you're giving me a hundred dollars. Whatever. Pick whatever you want. Oh, I'm not gonna be an asshole about it. But I still stand by the fact that you can't pick fake a doom or something. Okay. But whatever. I'm kind of biting my nails right now before you're gonna pick. Oh, okay. Also, also, um. Before you donate the fucking money, tell me the level and I wanna do a practice run of it. Please. You know? Okay. I'm waiting. What do you mean, fuck? I mean, if you already donated it, then it's fine. Because, like, you know, I can just... Although I'd imagine it would have appeared by now. Dre gives a shitty level, you have to do mental torture instead. Hmm. You're stuck between two levels, okay. I can just do a practice run of both of them and pick the one I like the best and or hate the least. Keep looking, okay. I mean, I've already completed Acropolis, so. God, I forgot to beat that. Fuck. Oh, yeah, actually, fun fact. I'm pretty sure one of those streams, or one of the Acropolis streams, um, no, I think the stream that I beat Acropolis, I'm pretty sure I got a furry porn level request. It was kind of funny, so I had to delete the stream. <laughs> Silent Club of Rome is an insane demon. It is top one harder than Blade of Justice. Yeah, harder than Blade of Justice. That's um, that's up there. Uh,
shaking in my boots for what this level is going to be. Oh, I forgot I had this thing. This is hilarious. I love this level. Oh yeah, I never made the gun turn with your icon though. It does shoot whenever you click. Okay. This is the absolute monstrosity <laughs> that I used to get it to work. <laughs> this was a monumental waste of time and I am proud of it. Okay. Um. Oh, I forgot I have a copy of this thing. Oh wait a minute, were you guys not able to, I am actually curious, were you able to hear the audio from the um, the Vietnam level? <laughs> it uses a, uh, oh fuck, what's that song called? Um, oh yeah, Fortunate Son, <laughs> it uses that song, that's what it's called. You know, the song that's in every Vietnam movie, I thought it was, I, I thought it was being truly hilarious with that one, hold on, I, I want to see... No, you could hear it, sorta. Of. Yeah. It was ha ha funny. How long did the gun take me to make? Uh, not long because I just stole gun art and then I just I did fill the gun in, like it was just an outline of a gun and then I just like filled in all the stuff and colored it and then uh, it was done. That was a funny noise. Also, can I talk about how goaded metal straws are? Like this looks fucking stupid, but it slaps. So, you know. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. Yeah, the guns in Oblivion. <laughs> that shit's so stupid. Also, hold on. I'm gonna text someone real quick. Two choices are Boom Shakalaka and Kids Smoke, okay. Wait, is that... no, it's two words. Okay, well, let's see what this is. It's a fun song name. Oh, 
Oh no. Um. Wait. This is rough. This insane demon definitely requires one extreme demon's worth of effort to complete. No question about that. And I don't know how- I'm probably gonna need to look up a video <laughs> for how to fucking- wait a minute. Dear god. Yeah, I'm gonna check out that other level first. Uh, kids. Oh, you had me do a practice of this at one point, didn't you? Isn't this like the super edgy level? I think it is. Yes. This thing. I can already tell you right now I might just end up picking this because uh, I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to deal with whatever that other thing was. I'll look up a video of the other level. This aged poorly. $200 for both? God damn. I don't know if I'm I don't know I don't know if I'm down for that, man. Cause I do want to make sure I'm actually able to play Arrow Gleam, you know. Actually wait a minute, what? Oh, okay. I couldn't tell if that was even like possible to get through there. Okay. This has some balancing issues. Oh, this exists. Holy shit. This is your favorite, okay. Bro, 250 Bro is offering $250 for me to beat both of these. Okay, hold on. Let me look up a video of the last... Uh, Alright, I'm willing to beat this one, okay? I'm willing to beat the one I'm practicing right now, because this is, like, a lot nicer, but... I'm like a boom shaka lock a GD to see what the fuck I'm going to have to be dealing with here. I mean, at least the level's, like, only a minute and a half, but... Oh my god, this looks really, really painful. Like, this is taking me multiple days to learn 100%.
That duel looks awful. Oh. Huh. I honestly don't know if this is worth my sanity. Three hundred, dude. <laughs> Bro is trying. Uh, mm. Dude, this level's gonna take like a week to beat, I swear. Uh, <laughs> what is that? Like, what is that? You'll mm. <laughs> pick another love. <laughs> No, 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 it's fine. I mean... Uh, I don't know if... Uh, I'm really thinking about it, dude. The $300 is very tempting, but that was... This is pain. <laughs> this is pain. Oh, wait. Shit. It switched in a level. I, I thought I was having a stroke. Okay. Like, let me just look at, like, I honestly just can't even size this level up by looking at it. Wait, what? This could not have been a worse cho- wait, what? This is absurd. Let me look at this one again. Or let me finish this practice run, I mean. This duel is interesting. Wait a minute. What if I just keep holding? Okay. Wait, no? Oh, I see. You hold until you're there. Alright. This shit's already learning on its own, goddamn. Is that not how you do that? Oh, you just hold there? No, wait. No, you. D oh, you hold on that one. Okay, that makes sense. And then, okay, I like swing copter. Swing copter is like fun and easy for me. It's not too bad. I mean, I'll definitely do this one. This level is actually somewhat fun in a few spots. <laughs> you do have a replacement for Boom Shakalaka, but the offer goes back to 200. I don't, yeah, you know what? Yes, because I don't want to do Boom Shakalaka. It's not worth my sanity. It's just genuinely not worth it. I need to think about, um... I need, yes.
Huh? What's going on here, though? Is it just broken? Oh, I know what Moth Melons is. Hold on. Also, I don't need to finish that Prax run. I, I'm confident that I'll want to do that, but... This used to be an extreme. UFWM beat this thing. Wait, is this wrong? Oh, you just keep holding, don't you? I'll beat this. Oh yeah, that's right. He did sell SpongeBob Soul for 62 cents. That's fucked up. I forgot about that. Wait, not broken be better? Wait, what? Yeah, I'll beat this. Fine, $200. I'll, I'll beat both of them. I'll get the coin, too. What? Thank you. <laughs> this this is truly epic. All right, I'm gonna be beating both of these then. Well, fuck. Should I just try to? Oh, oh, they each have a single coin in them. Oh no, you know what that means we gotta be getting those coins. We gotta get those coins. Actually, where do you know where the coin is in this? Also, um, I am gonna uh, end here, like, really soon. Actually, I need to end soon because the uh, movie thing. You can get the coin, okay. You think I was gonna do it? I mean, no, no, I'll do it. I mean, I'm not gonna be beating these like right away back to back, probably. Like, I'm probably gonna beat one of them and then play Aerogleam for like a few days and then like beat another one. I don't play any Smash Bros games. This isn't math. No, no, it's uh, I actually, you just reminded me that I named the stream title LNX, I, I forgot about that. I literally just couldn't think of what to like name the stream, so I just typed in LNX.
shouldn't be too bad. Yes, I did indeed count it all. <laughs> it's horrendous. It's ridiculous. He's definitely gone insane. No, that's 100% my salary. Oh, you want me to do... Okay, you know, that's fine. You're the one who donated the money, so if you want me to beat this first, I can. Here, I'll do one complete practice one of this, then I'm going to end, because I need to, but... um, <clears throat> I guess next stream I'll beat this. Or, well, okay, I'm not going to say that, because I don't know if I'll be able to beat it in one stream. Because I'm not like most people, but, you know. We'll see. Do you have to click both of those? I don't think so. No. Okay, that that's kind of cringe. You have to hit that really late. Jeez. Another one of my choices was going to be I stole this because that level is silly. Okay. Yeah, actually, you also made me do a practice of that at one point, didn't you? Um... Also, Lubu, what you doing, bruh? Um... I'm watching a bit of Crossroads, and how the fuck is that appealing in any way? Uh... Well, I don't know, because I don't know what that is, but um, I am kind of curious now that you say it's really bad.
Oh, that's actually fun. I do like the ship section, actually. I can tell it'll be really fun to do once it, once I learn it. I mean, this isn't the kind of ship gameplay that I would ever make, but, like, I mean, I like it. It's cool. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, this actually has some cool shit in it. But, like, in a good way, because it's actually fun to play. It's not, like, bad. I should stop saying too many good things about this before I start hating it, though. The gameplay is actually really straightforward, it's just hard to look at. Okay, that's a timing and a half, though. That's interesting. Not the biggest fan of this gameplay, I won't lie. This is kind of weird and not in a good way, but. Like, I real I don't like this ending. I have a feeling the ending is going to be the part that I'd end up despising the most. Is that a double click? Or no, do you have to go under that? No, wait, what? Yeah, it's a double click. This is ideal extended blister okay. Alright, well yeah, I'll beat that first for sure. Actually, you know, there's a chance I can knock that out in one stream if I try. I might be able to. I uh I'm just trying to lean towards underestimating myself because usually I expect to beat stuff way faster than I actually do, so. But yeah. I'm gonna end. Um, yeah. I will see ya. Uh... Yeah. Yep, tomorrow. We should be good for tomorrow, so. Alright.